Hi, welcome. This is going to be a quick reading. I am the Tough Love Spiritualist. Welcome to my channel, my new subscribers, my new followers. Hi, welcome y'all. Go on and hit the subscribe button. I'd love to have you. Hit the notification bell. Bing! Up right so you get notified when I do go live and I post content. Now, y'all can tune in, but things aren't always peaches and cream, right? Things happen, even for spiritualists, right? And it doesn't have to always do with love, right? It can do with family connections, interpersonal connections, right? Things outside of your control. And so there can be unfulfilled energy, even when things is going great right nothing's always peaches and cream so this is a reading to see what has been going on with me i've had some because again i'm transparent y'all right and so i've had some uh family issues and personal issues that does have to relate with uh someone very very close and dear to me here um that i am in a position of authority queen of pentacle here i am this person's queen of pentacle um a mothering figure queen of home here um, so let's see what, uh, was up with my energy that day. If you look at the short that I did, my significant other came over and, uh, we hadn't really seen or talked to each other that day. No, it was the day before. And he was like, what's up with your energy, babe? Everything good? He was like, um, there's a frustration type energy here. See, this has to do with emotions here. Three of cups in the reverse for me. This is a feeling of, um, discontent, things not really like there's something that you should be happy, but there's something that you're not happy about here when you should be. Um, it's, it's a frazzled energy here, um, an unfulfilled energy here. I wouldn't say a Debbie Downer energy, but uh, because again, y'all, I didn't even realize it. I didn't even realize I was vibing that way. I was actually very uh, flustered, you know, trying to get dinner done, trying to do uh, my reads in between, making sure that I was giving him his time when he was here so he didn't feel like he was over here for nothing um managing my own you know my own things trying to get my day wrapped up so I can relax with him but still making sure that I stay on on point and focus also not uh put off what was going on with me on him through projection but also be vulnerable let him know what it was but it, I guess it was just radiating off of me and what in the situation that happened it hadn't happened yet it happened literally 12 hours later. And so he actually said uh, last night, he was like, I can tell your energy's better now. You know, it's like after whatever happened, he said, maybe you had like a sixth sense that something was about to happen. And that's why you were in that energy, babe. But, you know, he, I was received with compassion, understanding. Um, he actually shared some things about himself from his life journey here that really show compassion, relatability here. Yeah, justice. I, I felt um, at the time, that something was um, unjust or was some or a situation was unjust when it comes to uh, something or a situation here where there's heavy investment, heavy responsibility here. Um, and it does have to do with Page of Swords, incoming messages here, um, the mind here, like something's not right. So I feel that there was a sixth sense that I had. So and you all, I'm just going to, I'll just share this. It was a sixth sense now that it's happened because nothing had happened at the time, right? I had no clue what was about to happen. But the next morning, this was like maybe at 10 o'clock at night. I mean, the next morning by 8 o'clock, 8.30 a.m., it had happened. I didn't find out until like 10 o'clock in the morning the next day of the night before why I was feeling what I was feeling. But again, that's why my energy was what it was. Yeah, I see the five of swords, conflict, like like something's not right. You know what I'm saying? Someone's going to try to get by with something or just something, something's off. I didn't know this. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't worried. Yeah, the magician in reverse, something wasn't going to work out here you know what I'm saying I had a sixth sense like something's not something's not something's not right so you know to the point to where it was it was in my spirit but I didn't realize it you know I guess that was me trying to push it down but whatever it was whatever it is whatever happened which it did this is just me letting the cards read me so y'all know what's going on because y'all might be able to relate right it was completely unexpected it has nothing to do with me but it's with someone that's very close to me that I'm tied to that I'm in a queen of pentacle energy with but everything's resolved now ten of swords the situation's wrapped up it's over now end of the conflict right but yeah yeah a judgment has been called will be called the judgment's here the balance is here but also 
there was, um, he was there for me in a time where I really didn't even expect it, wasn't looking for it, but he felt it. You know what I'm saying? So all of y'all kings and queens get in tune with your partner, um, the vulnerable side, the emotional side. And when y'all have things come up, uh, share it. Cause I didn't, I, I, I didn't really share for real. I didn't share the details, you know, um, he didn't cry, but he could feel it, you know? So yeah, the sun energy for me, again, everything's all good now, right? I'm on the other side and it was just for, you know, 